So I think what happens is I never intended for the MMORPG thing to become my career. I loved playing them. I legit love the genre. I love video games. And I think that kind of, I hope that shows whenever I make videos. But I just wanted to make videos and share them with people, man. I mean, when people say to me, what do you need to make a YouTube channel? What should I have? The answer, as cheesy as it sounds, is love. The answer is passion, man. Because you make a video with passion, you make a video with love for the subject matter, and it, it shines through. You can tell. You watch, I mean, an example that I was giving yesterday was H-Bomber Guy with his incredible takedown videos. Do you think H-Bomber Guy is just sat there researching things because he hates them? No, he loves that stuff, man. And you can tell there's this infectious um, passion that just permeates a video. When you watch a video from someone who loves the subject matter, I mean, Carl Jobst absolutely adores speedrunning. He just loves it so much. You watch any of his videos, you can tell that passion just shines through. So I was just making videos because I love them and I love the subject matter. And it seems that people loved them with me. And we just, you know, went uh, <laughs> we went along with that. That just kind of worked. How's the vlog life going? I haven't vlogged in ages. You know, when I was doing that vlog, the, the point of it was I knew that I wasn't anyone that anyone cared about at the time. I knew I wasn't finding a huge amount of success. It's, no one was going, oh my God, what's Josh doing? To me, that vlog served a very definite mechanical purpose. And that was forcing me to do something. That's honestly all it was. It was forcing me to film every day, edit every day, and get something out every day. Because the enemy of... Perfection is the enemy of done, as they say. If you try for too long to make something perfect, you just don't do it. So by forcing myself to vlog every day, I wasn't able to get the best camera angles I wanted all the time. I wasn't able to do the best editing, but what I was able to do was actually make a video. And that proved so valuable to me in the long run. It proved that when people say, oh, I'm a perfectionist, I'm a perfectionist. Okay, that, that can sometimes really harm your ability to make anything. You need at some point to say, right, this isn't perfect, but I need to get it out and get it done because then I can move on to the next thing. And the lessons you learn from creating the thing will help you when you create the next thing. And you've got to just move on from there. You, you learn, whenever you put something out, you always say, oh my God, I'm better than this. And you are, because the act of putting it out has in itself made you better. But you can't, you can't wait for something to be perfect before it goes out. If it's 99% done, that's okay, because that 1% will take more than 1% worth of time to create. In fact, in the time that you could have finished that 1%, you could have made 95% of something else. Perfectionism sometimes is paralyzing, and it holds you back from doing it. I mean, some people say about the Pareto Principle, the 80-20 rule, of the idea that if you've got 80% of something... so. You can make 80% of something in 20% of the time, and then the remaining 20% takes another 80% of the time. Eventually, you do need to say to yourself, right, I am going to just... I am done now. I am going to move on to something else. And you learn from that. I forgot where this quote started. Someone was said something to me about something. Yeah. Perfectionism is very rare, and people who have it tend to be crippled in many areas. That's very, very true. When people... It's that work thing you know when you're at the work interview and they say you know what's your biggest weakness and you say oh i'm a perfectionist what you're actually saying is i will never find the discipline to stop working on one project and start working on another it's horrible but at some point you need to say right i'm done here it sucks it very much sucks because it's, it's horrible to say 